we'll see. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Look at that, look at that. Hopefully we have some volume. Yeah, the uh, address. We don't? Uh, <laughs> Pino will uh, hopefully uh, give us the address. Oh, uh, let's put it right there. We got our CD. Is anybody on? Are we on? Two, four, zero. Two, four, zero. Logon Street. 240 Ligon Street. Ligon Street. Mondo. All right, we're going to go live. Do we have anybody watching? Oh, we got some people. We'll build it up. We'll build it up. Fortunately, it's 3 o'clock in the morning. It's 3 o'clock in the morning in uh, America, in New York uh, area. Hi, folks. Hi, everybody. No Ferone. No Ferone is watching. Ferone. No. Mr. Ferone, how What's are up, you? Buddy? How are you? Welcome, welcome. We are in Melbourne, Australia. Bronx, New York. My God, you guys are up early, man. Uh, Watching this. this can you hear awesome. us? Richie says yes. My sound guy says yes. This is He's awesome. the best. We are walking you around here with Listen, the Uncle Louis Variety here. Show. 240 Lagon Street in Australia. Melbourne, Australia is Piccolo Mondo. This restaurant, I am walking up to the restaurant. Yes. And the smell. I just ate. 20, maybe half an hour ago. We're smell hungry of again. This restaurant. I'm right. Like walking it's into our mother's deep. kitchen. It's, Nona's it's Kitchen. That's right. We're at Piccolo Mondo. This Piccolo is a uh, this is a, a gem. Let me tell. We're going to be talking to Pino Costa. He is the yeah. owner, I believe, right? He's the owner. The, of the owner restaurant. of the restaurant. He's going to be joining us. We're going to have a couple of drinks. We're going to have some food. This is fa coffee. Yeah, this is Australia food. style. We are excited to be here. We've been here uh, about three days now, and uh, Louis and I are enjoying ourselves. Beautiful yes. combinations. Beautiful yeah, people. Food has been outrageously delicious. Uh, yesterday we went to a beautiful uh, Italian dance. Yep. We ate well, and the smell here is amazing. I know it's going to be another great night of eating. That's what we've been doing here. Listen, you got to talk to this. You got to talk to this. Yeah, we are. We go to we go to the authentic Italian places. Yeah, you know the places we know that we're going to get good food, and as soon as we get out of the car, we smell it. Smell That's it right. Away. The smell is unbelievable. It's like the kitchen at Nunnas. It's beautiful. We can't wait. And, we, and the, the only problem we have when we go to these places is trying to figure out what to order. What right. So we order all of it. Want to order. So That's order right. Everything. I'll take the whole left side of the menu and a Pepsi. So let's <laughs> Pepsi, yeah, with a little uh, little crown in it. So we are at Five Coffee at the Piccolo Mondo, 420 Ligon Street. 420 Ligon Street, baby. That's in Melbourne. Australia. Australia. We made it to Australia. We're gonna we're gonna be uh, joined by Pino Costa. He is the owner. He's gonna be coming out here. Tell us about the restaurant. How long they've been doing it? How long he's been in Australia? All that good stuff on Australia on the street. Uh, long he been in Australia? Australia. About his whole life. How long have we been in Australia? Three days. Uh, and I feel like I've been here a month. I swear I'm to God, tired, in a good way. In a good way. Everything smells good. I'm we had a, I'm we had a great. Right uh, now. I can't even take it. We had a great day. So just to let everybody know. Uh, if you are in Australia, if you are in Melbourne, if you are in Sydney, we are going to be rocking and rolling uh, here on the 18th, I believe, in the Comics Lounge. Comics That's Lounge going to be 8 o'clock, am I right? Am I right? My people say yes. 8 o'clock show. 6.30 doors open. Doors open at 6.30. Get your tickets, baby. 7.30. Tickets are still on sale. Uh, contact Savannah Laird for tickets and Jeannie. Right here, our new waitress. Thank you very much. Look at this. Look at the timing on that. We got the t-shirts available right now. It's amazing. In Sydney, Sydney, Australia, we are going to be at Five Docks RSL on the 17th, Sydney, Australia. So if you if you want tickets, you can go to can go to the Uncle Louis. You can go to the Uncle Louis Variety Show, or you can just contact contact Savannah. Oh, Damien. Starting to roll. Damien. Damien. Uh, What's Damien's last him? name? Damien. Yeah, <laughs> what, what she said. So she has laryngitis, so it's going to be kind of hard. So we have our lovely people. I want to thank everybody. I want to thank Silvana Laird. Damien Cassaniti. Cassaniti. Damien Cassaniti. That's a good Irish boy. So uh, we want to thank Richie and Savannah. Ginny, our love. <laughs> She is uh, she is uh, taking care of us, and she's also the waitress here, which Union's is weird. Taking care of us. <laughs> she's got a new job. She says she's worked this every restaurant. Her job is scraping us off the floor and throwing us back in our hotel. So we are so. we are enjoying uh, a great night outside. Yes, it's winter back home, but here it's summer. We are outside. We are people. 
Moan Doe. We're going to eat. We're going to enjoy Pino. Uh, he's going to be telling us a lot about his uh, restaurant. Is he going to sing? He's going to sing. He doesn't know that yet, but he's going to sing. So we have our CD. Speaking about singing, we have our CD. It came out the Australian style. Australia gets it first, baby. That's why they're in the future. That's how it happens. Fog coffee. There it is. That's the front. That's the back. Makes sense. What other way? That's thanks to Richie right there. I'm gonna tell you right now. We were talking on the phone. Richie Laird. Yes. And he goes, you know what would be great? He's a. He is a legend. He's a legend. In his mind. Because he has to deal with someone on Laird. The legend. The legend. Everybody, give it up for Richie. No. So uh, we want to thank. We want to thank. Richie and everybody uh, getting the CD uh, going in Australia. Thank you very much. The girls and everybody else uh, with the t-shirts. We are so excited. They look great. They're going to be on sale on all the shows. They're, if you come down here, we're going to be here. We're going to be selling them right here. So uh, if you're close by, come on down. Shake our hands. Take a picture with us. Buy our stuff. Why not? You'll love it. Let's see. I'm ready to eat. So if you want to get Pino, yeah, we can, we can get Pino Costa. Uh, so, Louie. Yes. How are you? How are you? How are you doing? How many people? Well, we got. Let's talk to some people. Let's say hi. Yeah. You. That, that was you. That was your cue. So you people can see better than me. No. Hi, Let's see who's you? there. How you doing? Let's see how many people are there. Hi, Gina, Margaret. Hey, there's there he is. Have there's, a seat. Here's the man. Well, what do you want to sit right here? Oh, oh he's, he's good. good. He's no, good. No, no. He's good. He's good. No, no. Next to the. Next to the. Next to the. Make sure they see you. There you are. They see you right there. Ladies and gentlemen. You're the man of the hour. Of Australia. Pino. Thank you for coming. Pino Costa. We get out of the car. I ate an hour ago. I'm starving right now. As soon as I smell the restaurant. When I walk up, I'm just joking. <laughs> okay, you leave that up to me. You, you don't mind, Chief? Huh? No. Does anything. he mind it? You, you leave it to me and you leave it to me. Oh, right? see, that's what, so, that's what you maybe, want in a restaurant. Maybe, yeah, maybe, maybe get something to share. Yes, you know? sure, oh, yes. Yeah. So listen, a good restaurant, when you walk in hungry and the smell makes you... I mean, when you walk in full and you, the smell makes you hungry, you know it's a good restaurant. A good That's restaurant. what it is, right? Exactly. You can eat five minutes ago, you walk in and you're hungry. You're still going to eat. You're, you're going to eat again. We're gonna eat. You're going to eat, eat again. So that's how we are. So we right are now. here at Pico Mondo. Pico Mondo. Mondo. We have Pino with us. You are the owner? Yes, I am. Oh, my God. And how long have you been uh, in this beautiful establishment? Uh, this one here five years, but I, I've been in Lagos since 1986. You've seen a lot of changes, I, huh? I, I, I don't want to hear it. Oh, that's a great <laughs> haircut too. right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. yes. So you've been you've been on the street a long time. You've seen a lot of changes, obviously. Yeah, yeah. Good changes. Yes, some oh, good, some bad. You're still here, so. Still here, yeah. So five years. This is this is great. You get a lot of tourists here. You get a, I mean, how's that? What's the what's the build up? Is it more? Uh, townies, there's a lot of people coming out of different uh, the cities. Is something is happening around Melbourne. Mm -hmm. You always get a, a good share of uh, people. But you know, you get enough, you know, for bread and butter. With sure, regular, sure, sure. Regular cast. Right. Now, we we obviously been here two days. We've noticed that it's busy in Melbourne. There's a couple of things going on. We walked into a Greek fest and all that stuff. Do you guys get all that action as well? We do. We do, yeah. we do get a backlash from everything that's happening in Melbourne. Yeah. Like, you know, tennis is, is, is a good tennis. Yeah. Uh, tennis, yeah. uh, the, the, the uh, World Cup, if there's a World Cup, if there's uh, uh, car racing, you know, like motorbike racing, we do get a little bit of everything that's happening. Beautiful, in beautiful. We get our share. Of and I'm sure you have enough for your base customers so they keep coming back. 100%. 100%. <laughs> that's how that's, you know it's good key. when you can rely on just rely on base customers. Yeah, you're good. You're good. If you great. got that going for you, yeah. exactly. Yeah. 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 So uh, well, we're gonna I'll tell you as soon yeah. as I got out of the car. He enjoys the I'm cars. I'm smelling. You know, it's like Nona's house. You know, <laughs> <laughs> like I'm smelling everything. I'm like I when can't a wait, restaurant reminds you of home. And the good times, because food is very comforting, right? Yes. That's why we eat. We it's want to be to Italians, right? We want to be reminded. Italian, you don't like food, you know. For the Italian. Italians, it's a celebration. It is. Some some people eat to feel their stomach. Yeah. You know? but for the Italians, it is a celebration. To stay happy. You know? Like you know, I remember when I was a kid, we used to sit at the table, you know, grandparents and everything. Yeah. We used to sit there for five hours. Yes. 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 Five hours. <laughs> You know, like, yeah. That's how, yeah, that's that's how, how we that's grew, how grew up. up. Yeah. yeah, that's how we grew up as well in America. And the nice thing, talking about Piccolo Mondo, it is a small world because everywhere we go, 
it feels like even being Australia, Canada. If you're Italian, you're Italian. Everybody yeah. has that same like part of the family, blood. Yeah. Everybody does the same stuff. Traditions are the same, and it's that's so what I love yeah. about the Italian yeah. people. Yeah. We anywhere yeah. we move to, anywhere we migrate, we hold on to them. Exactly, <laughs> exactly. And that's because the, the first thing we do is we land in Australia. We're like, oh, where's the Italian restaurants? Exactly. Where's the ta- as soon as we get that whiff? Oh, that's it. I'm, we're going there. We're going. I'm telling you. Parked right here. Yeah. <laughs> we're not, I'm dying. I'm dying. We got to so, eat. So, so I'm, gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get things started for you guys. Oh, that would Pino's gonna get some what, food. What would be your signature dish? Yes. Here. What would, what do you recommend? Probably uh, the barbecue calamari. It's oh, one of the best barbecue. My najem is an idiot. Then, then, we got, my then we got the mussels. Yeah. Oh, my I'm father's jealous you. right now. That's what I'm gonna organize you. As sure. Country. Sure. And I'll, I'll choose another one for it, and then we we'll have some pasta. Uh-huh. Oh, so you can share, you can share I'm in it. love. I'm in love, everybody. So we'll, we'll, we'll get the entree going. Okay. And, and then I'll open up some Ladies and gentlemen, Pino Costa, he's here at Piccolo Mondo. Come on down if you are in Melbourne. If you're not in Melbourne, you're planning to come to Melbourne. This is where you want to be. This is where you want to eat Italian food or any kind. You guys have... Now, what you, your menu, is it all Italian? Is it different things? What do you got? What's your, what's your setup? Well, we, we, we try we try and kind of for everyone. Sure. So obviously, we got spikes, steaks, we got seafood, we got chicken, we got veal, yeah. and then there's all the pasta. So whatever you need, you, you, you can get it here. You cover all bases. That's, that's it. That's, that's the only way you can. Do. Exactly. You want a steak? You come here. You want pasta? You come here. And that's one of the things when you go to Italian restaurant. It's always iffy about the pasta. You know the sauce. Why? If it's not made right. As I said, important. More the bacino pasta, the bacino pasta, get to that good day. See, good content. The bacino pasta, yeah. You'll see. Beautiful. So he's going to get that started. We want to thank him. Thank you, Pino. You'll be coming in and out. This yeah, is awesome. I'll be coming in and out. Great That's place. Right. We're going to enjoy some food. We're going to talk a little bit. We're going to have some drinks. So uh, thank you, Pino. He's going to get going. So look at that. We're going to eat like kings. We're going to bring in some people. Anybody want to sit down with us, join us? We're going to eat like kings, ladies and gentlemen. This is how they do it in Australia. They take care of you. This is how they do it. We're going to have drinks. So what else? What up? Hey, Jeannie's right here. She's not this only a waitress. Jeannie. She's our baby right here. <laughs> and we have and Silvana. Silvana. So and we want to think. These girls are taking care of us. Silvana, get, get, get in there. That's it. Yeah. These girls right here, gold. Gold. Okay? Diamonds. They're taking care of gold and diamonds. Diamonds. <laughs> now, <laughs> Silvana lost her uh, her voice, thank God. But we're... No, no, no. I'm just kidding. So we're just... <laughs> She's only on half the stories that she tells us, so we're only about three, four hours instead of eight, nine hours. But we're okay. We're okay. We're it's all right. Uh, let me tell you, uh, while we have the ladies here, we just want to thank you guys for yes. bringing us out to Australia. I'm going to tell you, you guys always say this and that. Oh, my God. We are so thankful for everything you guys do from they know, are doing this. They're like, what are you doing now? Yeah. Where are you going? We need to pay. We have to pretend we, we were to ill today, so they would not. Get we need to take you there. We need to be. Like, Jesus. I can't I, believe you paid for coffee. I gotta That's go to the bathroom. One. That's all I gotta do. You're my boys. I gotta take care of you. You take care of us. Don't worry. We want coffee. We gotta get coffee. But we love you guys. Thank you so much. You guys are right working here. so hard. Yeah. And, and by the way, bottom of our hearts. we love the t-shirts. T-shirts. The t-shirts. <laughs> now listen, listen. I know I'll be warned. a lot of our American a lot of our American fans are sleeping. It's very late yeah, in America. They'll watch this like crazy. And They're gonna watch it. Up. But I know so. I know when Kiki Kiki's up. Watch you know. <laughs> Kiki's up. Uh, these are the T-shirts, Kiki. We were so going back that and forth about Marisa Kiki. Nesh, she's his best restaurant in town. Hey, Pino. Regina. Hey, yeah, five coffee, everybody. Oh, cakes. <laughs> so Pino is gonna bring out some seafood. So he's gonna have some mussels and some calamari. Heather some... Keenan's out there. She's not sleeping. She's watching. Oh, Thank God you. bless you guys. Up, God Heather? bless you guys. Nah. So we're gonna be uh, we're watching. gonna be out here for a little bit. We're gonna be doing. Uh, we're gonna be tasting some food. This is going to be great. Uh, we're talking about our CD. I know we had you had the pleasure of. Uh, hopefully, it was the pleasure of listening to it. Did you Did you chuckle? Did you a little laughs here and there? It was absolutely. Absolutely, I'm going to translate. Absolutely brilliant. 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 That's the only thing we've ever done that someone's called brilliant. No one's ever called me brilliant. If you read some of the titles 
of the songs and brilliant. I don't think. Yeah, they don't go together. But thank you. Love the producer and brilliant. Which is Savannah's favorite song? That's my song. It's her song. That's her favorite song. It's her wedding song, you actually. It's. Uh... Mom was highway to hell. No, just kidding. Just kidding. <laughs> He's, it's all true. So again, we are at Piccolo Mondo here at 420 Ligon Street. Uh, this place is hopping. It is a Saturday night, correct? Am I right on that? Saturday? No, Sunday. Sunday. She doesn't even know. It is Sunday. Right. It's Saturday night or whatever it is. So uh, we want to make sure everyone that's watching and uh, not watching will watch it later. Tomorrow we're going to be on the radio. That's right, 10 o'clock here, morning, America. Back in New York, it's going to be 6 p.m. Uh, on a Sunday. So we want everyone to watch us. We're going to be with Libby. She's going to be doing a two-hour show. Yeah, we're going, to be, uh, and we're going to be talking. Hey, slow down, Sailor. So uh, we're going to be doing a two-hour show. And uh, so we want everyone to check that out. But right now, we are enjoying the Piccolo Mondo. Oh, my God. So, what do you think, ladies? Are you guys having fun? Are we, are we a pain? Are we a pain? Tell the people how, how good we are. Yeah, guys are absolute pains. No, I'm joking. What? What? How did this happen? I thought we paid her. What is going on? Not enough, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> no, so, you guys have been great. You've been fun to see? be around, too. That's how she, that's, you know, she said that first. No, they're absolutely what? Your voice is great for interviews right now. <laughs> <laughs> She's got a radio voice, honestly. What's the Jesus? Believe me, mate. There'd be a lot of people out there that would be saying, yes. Yes. Finally. That you're not talking? Yes. That's we how it a, works? We did a little video with uh, her grandkids. Oh, we're going to put that out. We're trying to cut it up because it was complete chaos for like three hours. <laughs> so I'm cutting up the video and trying to get it done this week. I think I got I think I got an idea how I want to do it. And we're putting it together. It just got started. So, But it's pretty hilarious to try, <laughs> try to control the kids. But the kids were amazing, amazing. Vegan and Chelsea uh, were amazing. Uh, yes, yes. They, we went to the market so with funny, them. Hilarious. Vegan, that little one, he's crazy. He is so in a good way. Hilarious. Louis he's crazy so in a bad funny. way. Vegan's crazy right. in a good way. See how that difference is? He's so funny. When he, he, he's driving me crazy through the whole thing, and he's just funny. You, you so we went see. back to the hotel, and we were looking at the footage. Hilarious. I mean, he goes, I don't even know where to cut this thing. I, I don't know what to make of it. But uh, we'll try to come yeah, up with a video you guys thing, can watch. I have no idea what to do with this, but that's what I do with every video. That's and right. all of a sudden, things start coming together, and we'll pull it together. So again, um, if anybody's watching and we're in Melbourne, please come on down to Piccolo Mondo for 20 <laughs> Like on street. Uh, we're gonna have a good time out here tonight. We're gonna have a couple of drinks. We're gonna be eating. We're gonna be enjoying the people around us. This is a perfect place outside. Listen, I know back home we're snowing. It's cold. Don't be mad. Don't, don't hate. be mad. Don't be. We'll hate. be back. We'll be back for that misery of snow. But right now we're shovel. taking everything in. Taking everything in. I gotta get back a shovel of snow. Shovel it. Shovel it. Shovel it. You gotta fr so. freeze your coconuts off over there. Oh, so uh, the coconuts. <laughs> that's how it works. So we're gonna enjoy this summer right here, and uh, but hopefully we're bringing a little bit back for you as we're taking these videos, and you can join us on our journey. So thank you and enjoy throughout the two weeks that we're here. The people here in Australia have been amazing. Um, we <laughs> funny story. Uh, There's a funny we're story. At a hotel. We're on the balcony and we're seeing a park on the balcony. So we're looking at Beautiful the park, park. Trying to figure out, okay, we're going to go to that park. Maybe take a walk around and see what's going on in there. And then all of a sudden, we get down. Stick. What's the matter? <laughs> I'm going to talk loud so they can hear you. They can hear me. I got the freaking microphone right it in front of that me. That doesn't work as Yeah, well. it does work. You don't know. <laughs> all right. So anyways, we go down there and we walk all around the hotel. We can't yep. find this park. Nope. We're like, where the, where, where the heck is this park? Okay. Did he swear? So we walk into the, we walk in to the girl at the front desk, and we're like, look, I see a park. I swear, I see a park. I see a park from the balcony. Even he, even him. even I see it. So we're like, where is this park? And she looks at she us. She had this like, disgust look. Like, like what, what's your problem? Like, like we're, we're trying to pick serious? her up or something. And like. And then she figured out that we're idiots. Yes. And she got a smile it's, again. It's right over there. It's right in front of the hotel. We were, we, we were actually right standing in the park when we asked her. That's how close we were. She goes, it's right there. Stupid. 
<laughs> and we said, not that park. That's obvious. I meant the other park. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The one that's not across the street. Where it is. Where's breakfast? So today, so today, we walk in, and the, the other girl is telling the other girl about our story. Going, these are the two guys that asked me about the park across yep. the street. So they were giggling, and we're like, you're laughing at us, aren't you? And they're like, yeah. Yes. Yeah. And they weren't laughing with us. No. Laughing at us. Then we asked where the restaurant was, and they said, just turn around. Yeah. There it was. So, I don't read. I don't read. Sorry. Yeah. Please carry me, I said to her. I said, carry me there. We need help. So, no, that was our day. Yes, that was our morning. We were trying to find a park. That's what we do here. And today we found it and we walked it. Yes, yes. And we have some pictures. <laughs> so, I want to share it with everybody. We found some beautiful pictures of Australia. I think you've seen them. Now, that, that kind of encompasses the whole Australia thing, right? The, the photos? Yes. The, right? We're kidding. We're kidding. There's so many beautiful... Beautiful spots here, unbelievable. The building, the architecture is unbelievable, yeah. but nothing like Pico Mondo here in 420. Right, right? I'm dying right now. I can't wait. We're, we're gonna get, we're gonna get some uh, muscles, more muscles from Brussels. Uh, muscles from Brussels. We're gonna get muscles. We're gonna get calamari. We're gonna get uh, shrimp. We're gonna we get steaks. Barbecue. We're gonna get uh, ice cream. We're gonna, what are we gonna get? Barbecue calamari. Yeah, I love it. So that barbecue. So Pino, the owner, figure that out. Uh, said his his thing would be the barbecued calamari. We said okay. So hopefully he'll bring some of that out. I can wait. I can wait. Pino did not really. Okay, wait a minute. This is information you should have told me before he left. You didn't buy me I'm so glad she. Nobody can hear. Peter and his son, they actually go out and they fish for this stuff. They so ladies and gentlemen, not only are you getting amazing food, but they're fishing for the stuff themselves. And they're bringing it on the table, from the sea to the table. Unbelievable. This is why you have to come to this restaurant. Every other restaurant, they're frozen. I don't know if they're frozen. I'm just saying that. But I'm just saying here, I definitely know they're not frozen. Because he goes swimming in the ocean, brings them back, puts them on the stove, gives them to us. Unbelievable. That's the way to do it. From the from the ocean to the table. What we say here. Well she says here when she has a voice. From the water to the plate. From the water to the plate. We have from the farm to the plate. What is it? What do we I don't know. Okay, Louis doesn't really. He just eats. He's like a cow. I don't he just, just, just <laughs> I see a, a gentleman wearing our shirt. I love that. God bless you. Love it, Nick. Oh, look at that. Okay. Okay, Brunswick. Rock Brunswick. We got to love Brunswick. So we got some uh, we got some people walking by wearing our shirts. It's unbelievable. Thank you. Look at all the love. Look at all the hearts. Oh, we got people waking up, waking up to the Uncle Louie Variety Show. Fox San Diego, what's up? San Diego, we love San Diego. Linda, how are you? Margaret, how are you? Love you too. This is beautiful. We love you guys. We are having a great night here at Piccolo Mondo. I'm going to say the name as much as I can. So we got some hearts, we got some love, we're going to get some food. We're going to let you guys understand how delicious everything is. I wish you guys could taste smell a vision here. Out, I stop talking. Yes. No, once the food comes out, I just... Yeah. I'll just start I'll talk. He eats. You, you've seen this before. You see how this works. My food gets cold. He eats very well. And, uh, and then he talks for about a second, and I get to shovel food in my I mouth. I talk for a second because I have to grab my drink. So, uh, so thank you for watching Fat Coffee, Australia style. This has been a dream come true. We are excited. We cannot wait for the Melbourne show. We cannot wait for the Sydney she show. Just fall over. Did she just Things fall are falling over. over. Uh, no, she did. Jeannie just disappeared. She just fell. Nobody she fell. Just fell. No, did you fall? Nelly. No. Nelly. She fell. I thought she and fell. And she's back. No, I just got signals and they so just. So is everybody can everybody hear us? Just to let everybody know. Uh, as long as you can hear us, we'll, we'll keep doing this. Yeah. Uh I'm we'll show pictures of all the Well, I just see I just yes. left because I got signals saying that the food's gonna be coming out. So Great. So what we're gonna do also, what we're gonna do when we do at Fat Coffee, after we uh 
end this, we're going to take a bunch of pictures of the food and we'll post it as well uh, with the name of the restaurant and uh, the address and all that good stuff. We'll put that on our page. We'll take a bunch of pictures and we'll put that on there so you guys can watch. Piccolo Mondo. Piccolo 420 Mondo. Ligon Street. 240. 240? 240? My God, what is in this? I've been saying 420. 240. 240. Mondo in Melbourne, Australia. If you go to 420, it's the Grande Mondo. Now you don't want anything like that. Yeah. That has nothing it's to do with this. Way too big. Way too big. Stupid. Everything's to be here frozen. At 240 this. Street, Piccolo Mondo. Okay? No, you said 240, I think. 240, did I? I think so. What is in this? So we're gonna have to rewind. I don't even know what we're saying. So 240 Ligon Street. Piccolo Mondo restaurant. It so Jeannie amazing. says the food is almost coming out. We want to keep this rolling just a little bit so we can have the food experience, the reaction. I'm sure it's going to be delicious. Uh, I'm sure Louis is going to enjoy himself. That's how it works. Louis wants the food. Denise, how are you? Hawaii is watching. Hawaii, welcome Hawaii. Have we had Hawaii? I think we had. We had Hawaii. We had. So welcome to Hawaii. Bless you, Denise. Beautiful Thank state you. of Hawaii. Maybe we could do a show in Hawaii. How many Italians can we get in Hawaii? <laughs> Come on, let's see what we can work on that one. Let's see if we can get some Italians. There's Italians everywhere, right? You can go, except Italy, because everybody's a migrant. Italy doesn't have any more Italians. They're in Australia, they're in America, they're in South America. We're working they're... hard to make these two these two people proud of us on, uh, on Saturday and Sunday. We're going to be at the RSL. Monday, we don't care if they're proud of us. It's Five Dock RSL in Sydney, Australia. At Comic Lounge. I love making you try to talk. <laughs> and then, she was Sunday, screaming all be, night. Yeah. And our, oh, I love you. I oh, can't just, wait to wear those t-shirts. No. She was, it's Sunday. We're like the Beatles to her. She just screams and chases us all over the place. It's Sunday at the Comics Lounge in Melbourne, Australia. At the Comics Lounge. That's right. Get your tickets now. Get your tickets now. So there is time to get tickets. You can contact the ladies here, Silvana. You can contact Jeannie. And uh, we can get tickets out to you guys. Uh, you can go watch it. What, what happened? Oh, Madonna Mia. Oh, 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 Santa Maria. What happened? Sure, put it down. <laughs> grazie. Oh, my God. Look okay. At that. Grazie, grazie, grazie. So, uh, Louis, please uh, enjoy. Mm. Louis, ladies, please enjoy. Ladies, please. This is, this is fresh bruschetta. So, this, this is fresh bruschetta. We got this. Look at this. Finely Look at this. sliced tomatoes on top. Look at that. Nobody chunks that up. Finely sliced just, tomatoes. Oh, Richie, there you go. So we gotta we gotta feed everybody. This is delicious. Now I want everybody to take a look at this. This is what we started off with. We have some oregano. We have some olive oil on there. We have some uh, what else? Help me out, guys. Cheers to you. So we have not salt and potatoes. No. Uh, we have a nice toasted bread. So we're gonna start with that. So uh, Louis, I'll let him clear his uh, throat there. Uh, and we'll Amazing. be talking again. We are at. The Piccolo Mondo, 240 Ligon Street. 240 Ligon Street. We paid this morning. <laughs> oh, that's How we doing, buddy? So we got we got Rob here. We got Big us. Rob's in the house. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're gonna hang out with you all night. We'll just we'll, talk, we'll get rid of her. We'll get rid of her. Let's get Rob on here. So uh, we got friends, us. we got people coming out. We got friends coming out. We got Rob coming out. This is going to be exciting. Everybody's excited. Uh, so this is uh, again our start. We're going to start with this, right? Yeah, we get the first. and uh, I'm, I'm going to taste it. I'm done. He's going to finish it. <laughs> again, if you've seen the five coffee, five dinner episodes. Everybody knows that I never eat my food. And I Usually that. Kiki's with me and she doesn't eat. Louie, he has all the food warm and nice. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> he has to stay fed. That's that's a look at him. He's a gorilla. He, we have to think of, yeah, he's a he's a precious one. Ooh. So uh so you speak when you clear. So I'm I done. Have a bite. I'm done. I want you to clear your throat when you're talking about okay, and talk. <laughs> No, 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 talk. No, Rick, that oh, means, I have to talk. Yes, yes. Okay. Not inside your head. Well, Out, outside voice. All right. Angle. There's all kinds of cars coming by here. We got Mercedes, Lamborghini just went by over there. Lamborghinis, Ferraris, everything. This is what this what Melbourne's all about, baby. Piccolo Mondo. That was freaking delicious that I just slammed. You're cutting it up. What Did the you hell breathe? is the matter with you? Eat Did Italian you style. I want to be, I want to be, I want to be, come on. You're going to be, you know, like a little Chris. Eat the damn thing. He's so angry. 
I am mad. I'm mad at you. <laughs> oh my God. This is freaking unbelievable. It's a great bread. Oh. But the thing is, is it's you know, it's, it's not just you know, just slapping the tomato right? on top of there. With the it's a specific blend of tomato oil and spices and everything else. When you talk about the you know, because you can have anything. People can go to Wegmans and they can go to like a Wegmans. People who don't know Wegmans go to a grocery store and have a bruschetta. That's not a bruschetta. This stuff is made with specific blend of what they do here. And, uh, and every restaurant has its own blend. This is amazing. Let me tell you something. Even if you're not a tomato Just, fan. I thought you were going to eat. I'm done. I don't Shut eat up. like a horse like you. I have a piece and I speak. I'll tell it. Well, it's not even tell it. It's called phone I vision. Eat like a horse. Okay. If, even if you do not like tomatoes, you're gonna love these. I mean, they. It just. I hate I tomatoes. Mean, I ate them all. He eats bread and tomatoes, and he look at him. He ate that record time. Unbelievable food makes you forget what you don't like. That's how good it is. I ate my shoe. He ate his shoe. So um, again, they're starting this off with a bruschetta, uh, a fresh, fresh no. tomatoes, no herbs. I, I gotta hold myself in for that barbecue. Uh, so we're gonna have fun here tonight. I, I we're gonna be hanging out. We're gonna be talking. We're gonna meet a lot of people. This place is so good. Everybody here is so. Savannah forgot so pleasant. to uh, introduce us to, to Rob. Big Rob, introduce us to anybody. Just walk. Can we call him Big Rob? Like, is he, fun. Anybody to know he, us? He, he goes as Big Rob, so we can say Big Rob, and he's not gonna kill us. All right. So <laughs> I just want to make sure because he doesn't introduce us, so we don't know what's going on. I mean, she I has no voice. Was. So Big Rob is going to join us. We're going to be talking to a lot of people. So, um, all right, talk. I'm now going in for talk. another one. Italian style. So, I can't wait for this. I mean, this is the first time I've ever had any type of barbecue um, calamari. It's, that, that oh, was, look at that. Now we got Who a horse and carriage. This is amazing. <laughs> Just sitting out here. Your fellow we got family a horse horses. and carriages. That look horse. That. I bet that I bet I out eat that horse. <laughs> so again, we are here. Oh yeah, the horse the Mortadella Piccolo just walked Mondo. by. A mortadella is pulling the mortadella. Pulling basket. We are here at Piccolo Mondo. I know we've been on for a while now. Yeah. They're starting to bring out the food. We're starting to enjoy our food. It's unbelievable. Come on down here, 240 Ligon Street. It is happening. It's the place to be. You want to eat Italian food. You want to have steak. Anything in between. This is the place to come to. The people are going to treat you great. You can sit outside. You can enjoy the beautiful weather that Australia gives you. It's amazing because you look at, look at where we are. This place, this little place, yeah. Piccolo Mondo, is packed. Oh, yeah. Everything else. Like little people here and there. Rock and roll. So, oh, my God. So the... There's some oh, more food coming yeah. out. Here we go. There's some more bread. Oh my god. There is some mussels. No, what is this? Look at that. Oh my god, Jimmy see the color kitchen. God bless you. Alright, so listen, ladies and gentlemen. What's your name? Thank you. Martha. Martha? Martha. Martha. Thank you so much. We want to thank Martha. Hey! Kushi, Veneka, Veneka. Emushkali. Is that what they do? Okay. So oh, wait, wait, we got oh, more. Oh, look at this. Oh, my God. Let me show you. Let me just show you guys what this is. Look at that. <coughs> That's ridiculous. Oh, so this listen. So listen. Again, I'm not eat all this. they are they are feeding us. Uh, they are feeding us like we just won the lottery. We just won the food lottery, let me tell you, ladies and gentlemen. And if you want to eat like this, come on down. To Piccolo Mondo, you can have this lovely food, and uh, you can enjoy it. You don't have to just watch; you can come I've and eat. This is how it happens. What are you holding? I'm holding the last. Piece. I've, I've never seen muscle like this. this. I'm right. not a muscle guy, <coughs> but smell. No, smell. This is unbelievable. Smell. We are enjoying the finest foods right now. Amazing. This is how we do it. Savannah, I want to thank. I want to thank. I want to thank Pino and his staff. Wonderful staff. As you saw, we had like three or four. They even hired her for a second uh, to get us drinks. Unbelievable. We want to thank everybody. If you are in America watching us and you are coming to Australia, coming to Melbourne, this is where you want to be. And if you're already in Australia, and if you're already in Melbourne or you plan to come to Melbourne, this is where you need to be, right here. And if you're around tonight, we'll be here hanging out. Come say hi. Is this the uh, Calamari? That's Calamari. So, uh, Savannah, if you can... If you can oh, give me God. a little bit of that on my plate Robert and maybe a little. Uh... Oh my! Oh God! 
So right now I'm gonna try this and just put it in there. That's amazing. Oh, no, try that. I'm gonna try it. Okay. No. So I'm gonna don't mind me, but I'm gonna have a piece of this and uh, I'm gonna let Jeannie talk. Oh, oh my god. god. Oh. Do it. Obviously, they are loving the barbecue tomorrow. I love you. Oh my god, I'm gonna actually make love to this food. It is beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Let me. Oh, I don't want to talk with my mouth full, but I want to explain to you right now. If mm. food was heaven, we're in heaven right now. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's what we call fresh from the sea. Oh. Pino and Joe. Is it Joe? No. No, this, uh, you mean Joseph? No, his older son. Okay, so Pino and his oldest son, this is what they do. They they go to the waters and they bring back this heavenly food. And I'm going to try this uh, right now. Lou? I'm not a mussels guy, but this is delicious. Oh. <laughs> I, I really don't. I don't eat mussels. Oh my God, the sauce. I know everybody hates us right now because we're eating in front of them. I just want to let you guys know. But you know what? When you're in Melbourne, you you're going to thank us. Ramonda, you're going to thank us, please. Ramonda, 240 Ligon Street. The, this is amazing. Oh, my God. I, let me tell you right now. I wish I could bring my whole family here. Um, yeah. But I can't. So hopefully they can feel a little bit of this love that we're having right now with the food because it's amazing. Well, the oh. thing is, they know that you guys are getting well fed. Oh, without a doubt. Yep. So we, if they come back with a couple of kilos, don't blame us. We have to... Now listen, people that know us already know that we talk about... Obviously, look at Lou. He, he's a bear. I love this. We said, if we're coming to Australia and doing all these restaurant things... Peanut. No, no, I gotta stand. I gotta hug you. This, the food is unbelievable. That's, that's the food. This that's now good. is it true? She told me something that I want that I want you, Savannah, if, for a second. Can I have Pino for a second? If you want to sit down for a second? <laughs> now, Jeannie was telling me that she said, You guys don't even know that he actually catches and goes fishing. This, and you know what? This time I was the only, the only one doing it. And diving. Masa was only cleaning him up. So every single one went through my hands. But I don't know if you understand what is going on. This man fishes, goes in the water, and brings these back up. <coughs> Everything. You know what? Honestly, I don't eat mussels. <coughs> oh, these are amazing. This is these amazing. 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 I do. My, my mother's father, like, why don't my you father eat these? was why here. Don't you eat them? I'm like, ah, I'm yeah, not really. Yeah. Now you know. Now you know what to say. This is amazing. When she says, "Why didn't you eat them?" You these can are, say, "Cause they're are, not like Pino's." These are good mussels. Yes. This is Pino's. Well, mussels. Well, made his back far, and his mother goes, "I saw you eating mussels in Australia." <laughs> She's gonna kick my. So let me tell you. So let me tell you. From sea to table, this is where you get the food. This is where you want to be. Two forty. Ligon Street, Piccolo Mondo. It is a Piccolo Mondo where we can get together from America to Australia and we're sitting at the same table and so enjoying this. World. It's a small world, buddy. It's a small world. God bless, man. This is the best, man. I, this is unbelievable. unbelievable. That is meat. Good, good. Uh, Pino, you're a good man. You're a good man. So, uh, you're enjoying everything. Oh, yes. So, let's look. Look at him. He's eating like a king over here. So, ladies, thank you, Savannah, for doing that. I just want to want to talk to Pino. So, we're going to, uh, I don't know how much longer we want to do this. Uh, what do you guys think? An hour. An hour? All right. How many people, are, I mean, are they enjoying it? Are you guys enjoying this? Um, I know it's late. Yeah, we did so much. Pino just brought the house down with this stuff. Yeah. Amazing. So, any pasta? Over here, we got the muscles. My mother is freak on these muscles right now. My whole family is freak on this. This is amazing how they did this. All this stuff. Oh. We want to thank you so much. So listen, guys. Thank you. Uh, share. I know a lot of our. Uh, share, hold on. Share, share, I know a lot of our American uh, viewers are sleeping or not uh, watching right now. Uh, please, when you get up or when you get to your uh, telephone or your computer, please share this. We want as many people to uh, enjoy what we're enjoying well, right now. I know now. about this hidden gem right here. Piccolo Mondo, 240 Lagon Street, Melbourne, That's right. Australia. So if, you're, if you are watching and you would like us to come to your establishment, 
uh, in Australia while we're here or back at home, uh, just inbox us. Get in box the show. You can get a hold of uh, myself. You can get a hold of uh, uh, Louis. You can get Joe a hold Flores. of Keith. Is how long we're going to be here? We're going to be here probably. We're going to be hanging out, right? Hour or so yeah, hanging we're going to be out, Joey. Come on down. Yeah, come on down. Um, so if you guys want us, Lucy, you rock, Lucy. Lucy, we love Lucy. Hi, one of our Lucy. super fans. Everybody. Uh, so we want to make sure that uh, everybody can enjoy this. So if you have an establishment, a restaurant, anything that you want to have people know that your food is as good uh, as Pino's, please get a hold of us. Uh, get a hold of the girls here in uh, Australia. If uh, if it is a restaurant in Australia that we can do while we're here, we can try to set it up. Uh, oh my gosh, you didn't. So thank you everyone. We're going to enjoy the rest of the night. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, little fog dinner. And uh, we know we did. And thank you again, Cher. We love you. Again, 240, Ligon Street, Piccolo Mondo. We're all family in a small world. That's it. See you guys. See you later.